YouTube. We go. Your boy, we go here. Uh, right now, I'm in my old family pond like I was last week. Uh, just checking it out and see if I can catch any bass. They had lockjaw last time. So it's warmed up a little bit. And uh, um, I'm hoping they're going to start bite. It looks like the hydrilla that was blooming just kind of died back. It's still got some flowers and stuff, but it looks like it's going to kind of stop. What's up? We got somebody in here. I don't know what time it is. I just kind of started it. So if I'm a little early, apologize. Nothing's happened yet. Just hanging out for a second. Got all my tackle and stuff together on the bench here. I can show you what's going on. I got a couple spinning rods. Uh, they're the same. Seven foot medium action rods. And then I've got a pile of worms here. On one of the rods, I have a chatterbait with a red worm on it. And on the other rod, I've got a red speed worm. So I'm starting off with red. We'll see how that goes. Um, this side of the pond is kind of slick. What's going on, man? See, I got two you guys in here. Appreciate it. Vic, what's up? What's up, brother? Appreciate it. Alicia Alley, I'm here. What's up? Vic, uh, Lucas, right? So anyways, yeah, I'm at the pond. Got five of you guys here. Okay, I, I kind of might have started early. I didn't have a, once I pulled up the live, I couldn't see what time it was, so. I was like, well, I'm ready. I'll just kind of start slow and let, let everybody kind of filter in here. But <clears throat> so basically, I'm fishing the pond here today. I've got a couple spinning rods. I'm going to start off with, uh, with a red chatterbait, and uh, I got a red speed worm. So I'm running kind of light because. Uh, most of my stuff's in my boat. We're going on a trip here in a couple of days. So I got the red speed worm, the Wego worm. Got the fin on it. See that, guys? It's my custom bait. Appreciate you guys tuning in. A Lewis. Okay, cool. What's up, Lewis? And then I got the white chatterbait with a stick bait, the hexagon. We're not sure what we're going to call this yet. This is a uh prototype bait it's gonna be for sale soon what's up andrew poland i watched your video buddy glad to see you back on the water looks like they were they were uh being tough huh we got nc deftones what's up bro what's up appreciate you guys if you don't mind subscribe uh today andrew i'm just in the pond i just uh i don't feel like getting the boat going we got a big trip going to keenansville uh bmaz and uh and no name bassin so uh the boat's kind of set i don't want to mess with it so i just grabbed my poles and went over to the family pond so, see if you guys see the background i got some of my tackle set up here i'll show you here in just a second i know your name is lewis yep i just want to make sure i always i'm bad with names dude i just want to make sure nice i caught a 15 inch bass the other day cool 15 inch bass that's I'll, we'll probably catch something i hope i'll catch something like that here in a minute this pond's full. I've been stocking it for like eight months. So I've put probably 60 bass in here. Some, some of them are like around uh, three, four pounds. There's an eight pounder in here. And so there's some smaller ones. So we'll see what's biting here in a little bit. Sweet. Is Eddie up to 40? I had to. Yeah, dude. He got me 40, Vic. Eddie got me 40. He had to leave. I appreciate you though. You get, Hey, Vic, I learned my lesson. This is actually the bait that Eddie was, he left it on my boat. So I took it, right? I didn't say anything. but So I got it tied on. We're going to see. Vic called this bait the other day, guys. Shout out, Vic. Shout out, Vic Sweet. So the white chatter bait, Eddie was killing him on this thing the other day in uh, Lake Dora. So he left it on the boat. I didn't take it from him. He left it. Lewis asked how I am. I'm doing good, Lewis. Uh, long. It's hot out here, man. It's like 80 degrees, so. It's uh, a little warm out here. I got my bug spray, though. We'll see it. Sorry, I had a phone call there. Might get another one. Andrew got more coming. Chatterbait was on fire all weekend. Okay. So the pond's kind of slick on this side, and then it's it's got some chop on the other side of the wind's blowing. So I was thinking about starting on this side with the, with the Wego worm, just a speed worm, with a little uh, eighth ounce. Uh, well, not eighth ounce, sorry, about a quarter ounce uh, bullet weight on it. Both of these things have already caught fish, so they're a little beat up, but 
Uh, this plastic we've been using, Serious Baits, that's our bait company. Uh, it holds up really good. So you can get multiple bait, uh, fish out of these baits. Steven Jr. says, hey, I love fishing. Cool, dude, if you don't mind, subscribe. And you get to see me fish all the time. I'm fishing Keenansville on Friday with small water charters. Uh, no name Bassett and BMAS. That'll be pretty big. We're going to make a video out there. I'm not sure we'll be able to go live because um, this internet service isn't great out there. So we're going to see what we can do. We're definitely going to shoot videos and uh, it should be a good time. Deftone says he cooked a 15 inch bass. Okay. We're going to throw these back because these are for fun. But um, 15 inch bass is probably the good eating size. Lewis says it's one of. It's one in the morning in Romania. Man, you're always up late checking me out. I appreciate it. I should have probably got started a little earlier, but I didn't wasn't sure I was gonna get here so early. Big sweet, nice. Would you uh would have done the same? Yeah, as far as taking that bait. <laughs> it's working, right? It already cost me 40 bucks, not throwing it. Look, B, I don't I don't love fishing. I love angling. All right, I heard about that. Gotta hit the right angles. Deftones. I've heard gummy worms work well because the colors make easy to see. This thing's pretty gummy here. This is my custom Wego worm. It's had some fish, so it's you know it's been hooked a few times, but uh, we designed it with this fin on the top. Keeps the speed worm nice and true. It's a little bigger rib than a little longer uh, worm with a little smaller tail than a zoom, but it holds up better than a zoom. Lewis says he set a timer to get up to watch. Wow, dude, that's that's awesome. Appreciate you, Lewis. That's a real, that's a real sub there. All right, I'm gonna throw the worm a couple times. How about it? Let me show you what I got just for later. But um, I got it set up here. Uh, let me let me take you guys off of here real quick. All right. I'm going to turn you around. 13 of you in here. That's my number. If you guys don't mind, pop out of the chat real quick and just uh, give me a like and come back to me. Nathan, hi. What's up? Luke B says he used to eat striper. But um, the small ones, I think he's, uh, and he likes crappie to eat. Yeah, I heard those are great. Deftones typically use crawlers because I love, love them. Bass love them. Yeah. What's up, Nath? Thank you. I appreciate you guys tuning in. So here's my little fishing kit, guys. I got my rods. I got a couple rods in case something happens, right? One rod's never enough. You don't want to waste time retying. But we got a couple options with these rods. So we can uh, throw two different things. One's going to be a little quieter. They're both moving baits. And one's going to be a little louder. I got my scale here in case we catch something. We'll see what, what it weighs. Got my wacky rig pin. We can throw a wacky rig at some point. My scissors. Got a black, uh, black and blue jig here with a little, uh, with a little, what do they call that? But anyways, a little trailer here, a little black and blue. Can't think of what it's called. And then I got a, a black spinner bait. This water's real dark, so dark colors work in here. I got a white jig with a kicker on it and i got my uh spinner bait my white with gold willows so this is also good dark water and it's quieter than the um than the uh, colorado blade on the black uh got a whopper plopper i got a couple couple creature bugs these are all serious baits right here these soft baits i got two different colors of sticks here's my wego worms i got red and I got purple, and we got a pile of the baits there and some tackle there. So, all right. Anyways, well, without further ado, let's get to fishing. Lewis says he's going to support me for the rest of his life. Well, I hope you live forever, brother. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate the love. Deftones. You got to go, but it's nice dropping it in. Thanks, Deftones. Check it out. Make sure you, uh, Subscribe, brother, and uh, hit the notifications to all, and uh, it'll let you know when I go live. I go live all the time. Chunk. Thank you, Andrew. That's a chunk. You're right on the jig. Yeah, I couldn't think of that. Thanks, brother. I knew you'd know. 
All right, guys, got 14 in here if you don't mind. Subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to hit a thousand this week. I think I'm like 940 or something. So uh, we're getting there. Let's start. If the sun's starting to go down, uh, it's starting to get a little cloudy. It was really sunny here a minute ago. I was watching. I didn't really see any action. I was just kind of sitting here watching the pond, just kind of see what was going on. I'm a little behind in the chat here. Lewis says, I want to want to become a channel number. What's that mean? You need to become a moderator. How about that? Appreciate you so much. Let me get some other moderators in here. Andrew's a moderator. So I set Lewis to a moderator. Yeah, okay, I got you. Thank you, I appreciate it. I don't know why you weren't already. I just hadn't paid attention to it. So I definitely need some mods in here. All right, well, look, I'm going to, the wind's starting to pick up a little bit. Let's throw the, let's start quiet. Let's see what's just, before we throw that chatterbait, let's just start quiet. You see the wind starting to blow this palm frond behind me. So I'm in Fort McCoy, Florida, guys. It's about 80 degrees. The sun's starting to set over these trees. So we got a little while before the sun goes down. So. I'm going to set you up here. I'm going to throw in this little open area. It's probably the easiest spot in the pond to fish. Set you on a tripod. Level you off. Okay. So what you do as a moderator is if anybody's um, making nasty comments, because you never know on the internet who's coming through here. It's like the Wild West on the Vertical Live. Uh, just moderate i think you can click on it and uh you know maybe you can warn them and if it just seems like they're going to be a nuisance you can either block them or something like that so but i appreciate you let me throw the worm a couple times here i'll bring you down here with me wind's starting to blow you guys hear the wind is that getting loud let me know Make sure I check my drag. A little tight. Probably fine. I got some big fish in here. I guess you can't see me. Let me move you a little bit. Sorry about that. There you go. Wind's not too bad. Okay. No, it's Lewis. Yeah, that's what I said. Okay. A little bit windy. Okay. See if they'll hit this red worm. You guys don't know, but if I get to catch a fish, I get a little excited. So I don't know if Andrew's here, but I'm running this. Uh, I'm gonna run this worm right across the top of this hydrilla. I don't know if these fish are down because I'm around the edge of this thing. It's got a pretty good color of hydrilla. What have we got here? What's happening, guys? I'm trying to do a little pond fishing. See if we can have a little fun. What's happening to the chat? It slowed down. Got yeah, 10 of you guys in here. Let me know. Let me know what you want to do. I got a speed worm right now. Trying to catch some largemouth bass here. Appreciate the love, guys. Appreciate the love. Kind of nice out here. Actually, the sun's starting to come out a little bit, but. Ooh, there's a little gator in here, I'm seeing. Uh oh, little gator's in here.
Maybe he's been eating my bass. We've got a few gators in here already. Big Sweet says, Mondo's, let's go. Should I switch over to the chatterbait, Vic? I just saw a little, like, three-foot gator swim across, right across from this island right here to the middle. I threw over there. So I could catch a, ga a gator here in a second. Oh, yeah, he's hunting. He's hunting my worm. You guys want me to catch an alligator? I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I'm scared of him. Slow down with the worm, Vic says. b Maz here. What's up, brother? Man, I'm out here fishing the pond. I got a little gator out here uh, chasing my, my Wego worm. Got the red bug on right now, guys. See that fin? Makes it different. Ow. Got some thorns I'm standing in. Lou says, what should I do as a moderator? Uh, just moderate. Moderately. Yeah, there's a little three-footer in here. He's little. I should probably set a pole. Y'all want me to catch that gator or not? B-Man's lost three bigs today? Uh-oh. Sounds made up, bro. I'm going to take the worm off. Use my Swiss Army tooth. What y'all up to tonight? Appreciate you tuning in. Uh-oh. I almost lost my weight. But I got it. You'd be moderating that gator if he gets next to you? Yeah, I'm scared of this gator too, but. Thanks, Andrew. Appreciate the moderating mentoring. Sometimes you need a moderating mentor. Is that a thing? I think it just became the thing. What should I do as a moderator? Just chill. It's all good. You see somebody say something nasty, just delete them. That's all. Not that big a deal. Thought you wanted to be a moderator. Sorry, I'm trying to tie this knot. I got too much tension on the line. Come on, guys. I only got three likes on this deal. Come on now. I know I got at least five of you in here that are loyal. I don't know who the rest of y'all are. Oh, there's five of you in here, so you should all be loyal. I'm going to throw this speed worm, this Wego worm, weightless. Oh, it's all good, Lewis. It's all good, dude. This is a horrible knot. Okay, I think it's going to work. Put that Wego on him. No, it just means is you're a moderator because you're like somebody who like is in here all the time. And, uh, you know, I can trust that if I'm not paying attention to the chat, um, you know, you're there to like, you know, clean up the chat real quick before it gets too dirty. You know, you see a bunch of people like get doing silly stuff in the comments, just, uh, you can click on them and probably delete them and probably put them on, uh, like a 24 hour or something break or something where they, they, have, they can't even, they can watch, but they can't comment. Oh, you was the three. Thanks, Vic. Appreciate it. Ooh, that gator's coming at it. Can y'all see that gator coming? Do you see him right? Right? 
It's right there. Keep coming. Watch this. The skater's going to hit, hit this wiggle worm. So I've already caught bass on the wiggle worm. Gar. Mudfish, and now I'm about to catch a gator. Oh, there he is. Where are these little things coming from? Here it comes, here it comes. Oh, we missed it. Do see him? Do see him right here? He's right here. Watch this. Watch these little gators, man. They're freaking... Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him, guys. Got him. Oh! This gator's pulling drag. We got a gator, guys. We own. Gator on. Gator on, guys. What'd you say about that? Let's get him in. I don't know, man. I got like 10 pound line on this gator. He mad. Let me let him go. I'm going to let him go and see if he'll run away so I can get him out of this drill. He's bogged down in here. Oh, oh, there he goes. Watch my fingers. All right, I will. It's going to take a while to get him in. I don't know if I can get him in. Let's listen to him. Welcome to Florida, guys. I got a gator on. I really do want my fingers. Gator. Oh, here we go. Oh, shag. These little things are so aggressive. Is there another one? No, I think it's a stick. Oh, this little gator's wearing me out, guys. God. <laughs> if you got, if you guys haven't, dude, subscribe. We've got a gator on the line. Uh oh, I'm bringing him up. I'm bringing him up. Let me move the camera a little bit. He's going to come right out of here. I'm not sure. What's up, Hellcat? I got a, I got a alligator right here. A little gator. I got him on the line. Though. He bit my worm. He ain't happy. He ain't happy. Oh, he's like right there. Should I lip him? Dude, I'm starting to sweat. Man, he's like right here. Oh, it broke. Yeah, he just took off. He just took off. Broke. Dang. Broke off. Sorry, guys. But honestly, what was I going to do with him? He'll probably pop up. I'll catch him here in a second again. He's a little bigger than I thought he was. Dang, dude. He was just bogged down. There's so much, there's so much I drill it, like right on the collar of this stuff. Like it's all, all that is like all hydrilla. So he better not be in here eating my bass, man. We got to get him out of here. I'm not going to get him out of here, though. I just try to catch him for fun. They're pretty, those little gators are so aggressive. It's, it's crazy. 
it makes you wonder, like, if the big ones were that aggressive, man, they, you'd be hearing of stories about people getting in all the time, but it's just the little ones that act like that. Let me, pull, let me point this camera up a little bit. Sorry about that. Sorry I missed him, guys. Oh, well. They're easy to catch. There's a shot I catch him again as soon as he pops back up. But I broke my line off. I... I had him right, right here to the shore. It's just he was bogged down in the in the grass, and he wasn't gonna have it. I got only have ten pound line and twelve pound, uh, twelve pound leader. Appreciate the love, guys. Worked my butt off for that one. I guess we're catching gators today. So let me put you guys somewhere right here. This is where I'm gonna tie up. We got some. Something going on in the chat. Let's see. Oh, man. A little gator wore me out. Dude, he was pulling. And it's like 85 degrees out here. So, what's happening, people? We go here. We just hooked into a, a little gator on the Wego worm, and he took that thing to the house. Lewis says, I watched a live stream and they're really mean. Uh, the big gators aren't too bad. Like, we swim with them all the time and we don't even know it. Andrew says, Good fight, though. Yeah, that was fun. That was like catching a 30, uh, 30 or 40 inch snook. Andrew, what do we say here? Good fight, Andrew. Andrew says there it's mating season. Yeah, yeah, but dude, we're like a mile from the river. That little thing, there's no bigger gators around here. Like, I haven't seen a gator in here in years. Or not years. I haven't seen a gator here in months. So, appreciate you guys. Got 14 of you tuned in. If you don't mind, subscribe. Trying to get 1,000 subs, guys. Been working hard at it. Cool glasses. Yeah, these are... Uh, these are polarized glasses so I can see down through the water. They're coasters. I got like three pair. One I actually sat on the other day, so they're broke. But you can buy parts online and get them fixed. So anyways, let's uh, tie back on this leader. I'll tell you what we'll do. Since we already got the chatterbait tied on, and if Vic Sweet's still here. No flint on the ground out here that I know of. There's some petrified wood that came out of this hole when they dug it out. Um, we're going to retie that line in a little bit. We'll throw the chatterbait, see if we can catch one. Hopefully that little gator's depressed about getting hooked and, uh, he leaves us alone else. He could be coming to since all day. Andrew. Yeah. Hopefully there's no big gators, right? I hope they didn't eat all my bass I put in here, dude. Makes me wonder. Like, it's been a little tough to catch them lately. Now I, now I see a gator out here. So we're going to run this live chat about an hour, guys, and then I'm going to call it. So we're about halfway through. Appreciate you guys tuning in. If you haven't, go ahead and like and subscribe. Back out of the chat for a second and just hit the little like button and pop right back in. I appreciate you. Um, and please subscribe. And uh, when you the notification bell click it to all that way you can uh, get the alerts for when i go live i live fish all the time where's the gator he's down in the bottom of the pond chewing on a wego worm right now dude he got away from me but i got the chatter bait this is what eddie or yeah eddie was using at lake dora on uh on all well, all weekend and he caught he caught some nice ones so That's what I'm dealing with. Every time it gets close to the edge, I mean, the whole side, the whole, this whole little pond is just covered with this crap. So I don't know if it's going to get worse or what, but Andrew, they won't eat all of them. Bass are able to swim away. Okay, cool. Lewis, love you guys. Love my sub. 
Appreciate all you guys hanging in there. I'm having to rip it up as soon as it gets close to the collar. Sorry guys, something happened to the live there. Oh, that's cool, man. I'm here for you. I could be a role model. I'm back. Back again. Sorry about that. I don't know what happened to the live. It literally just cut out. So I don't know what happened. Are you guys it says it started the time over. Did it did I just come back? How'd that work? Thanks, Andrew. Appreciate you tuning in, buddy. If you guys haven't, check out Andrew's Pulling Fishing. He's uh does a lot of Florida bass fishing. He's really good. So if you guys want to see how it's really supposed to be done, check out Andrew Pulling Fishing. Appreciate you, Andrew. Thank you, buddy. One thing about this chatterbait, it got it has an open hook on it. So it's catching this grass. Yeah, Lewis, you should take up fishing if you haven't already, man. I love bass fishing. Like right now, as them clouds start to set, like the conditions are changing, like different things are going to work. So definitely, Lewis, check out fishing, man. Make sure uh, if you haven't already, haven't tried it, try it. Kaza, one, two, three. One, three, two, sorry. Hi, what's up? Appreciate you. If you don't mind, hit the like button, subscribe. I get the right number of subscribers, I'll catch a fish, I'm sure. The universe works like that. Yeah, so. Yeah, it's gotten cloudy all of a sudden. I mean, it was, before I started the live, it was like sunny and hot. Now it's cloudy. So this like chatterbait's going to start working a little better. Yeah, I'm starting to build a community of uh, other guys who uh, do live fishing. So uh, the live stream's going to start getting a little cooler because I'm gonna I'm gonna have some people on, just kind of you know, from around the country. I've met a few different guys, you know, Dan the Fishing Man, and uh, Swamp Nation Outdoors, B-Maz Fishing, No Name Bassin, and. Uh, you know, start doing some like uh, dual lives and vertical lives and things like that. We got some things going on in the chat here. All mods we have to talk. Uh oh. Am I in trouble? LG says my grandma and grandpa went deep sea fishing a few days ago and trolling tuna and wahoo, but didn't. Whoops. But didn't catch anything. So bottom fished, and my grandpa caught a 20-pound hogfish. Wow, that's huge. And we ate it. I heard the hogfish is amazing to eat. That's so cool. Lewis, I want 
to be a member. Oh, I haven't started a membership yet. That's that's a good idea. You know, if I get to a thousand, I'm gonna have to start getting kind of creative like that. But I think that because I have under a thousand subs, I'm not sure I'm allowed to have members yet. But I'll look into that because. I'd love to have you, make you guys a member. I don't know how to do that, but definitely uh, we're going to look into that. My ch the channel's so new, dude. I just started this thing in November, so, you know, I haven't learned all the little tricks, but we're getting there. Hellcat says his dad's starting a YouTube channel soon. That's awesome. I saw his boat. That thing's sick. Is he going to do a fishing channel? What's up, Becky? Oh, looking forward to the Friday video. Yeah, so... Becky's referring to Keenansville. BMAS, uh, fishing, we go fishing, no name bassin and small water charters are doing a a little fishing Friday together down in Keenansville, which is like somewhere around Okeechobee. It's the Okeechobee waterway. So I'll be more of an expert after Friday. So that's just in a couple of days, guys. I don't know if I'll be able to go live down there because they said the internet service is poor, but we're definitely gonna shoot a video and we'll probably go live on the way home. And the trucks, it sounds like fun. Oliver Bailey, hi, what's up, dude? I'm going to make Oliver a uh, moderator. Oliver's o OG on the uh, live chat, dude. He's been around a long time. Oh, so your dad's doing a channel, but it's not a fishing channel. Okay. Becky's looking. Hi, Oliver. Oliver, where am I at? I'm in Fort McCoy, Florida. North Central Florida in the woods, about to get start getting bit up by mosquitoes. I'm at the pond. Stock this thing full of bass. I just had a gator on. I caught a gator a second ago. Well, I didn't get him all. I didn't land him, but he was uh, like all the way to the land, and he just broke off. Yeah, you'd have to pay if you remember. That's cool. I haven't, you know, I haven't made any money at this yet, so. Yeah, okay. Hellcat says you had something different. What's the channel going to be about, Hellcat? I'm looking for uh, largemouth bass. I've stocked this pond. I just caught a gator, though, a minute ago. That was kind of cool. So when the live's over, you can go back and watch it. Cookie, hi, Cookie. Subscribe, Cookie. Thank you. Lewis asked if I have to pay to be a member. I guess if I make a membership, it'd be to make money at it, so but I have to figure out what I can give you for your money. You know what I mean? I'm not just going to charge you guys money for watching me because you don't have to do that. Cookie, I'm trying to catch some bass. LG, my PB bass is 8.5. That's awesome. That's a big one. I've caught three over nine. There's an eight. Uh, there's a seven and a half pounder I put in here a while back. She's probably getting close to eight. All of her nice. No, it's going to be official channel called All Fishing, I think. Oh, okay. So it is fishing. Have to pay to be a member. Thanks. Want to support and pay. Thank you so much, Lewis. So when I get to a thousand subs, which is real soon, hopefully, and I get monetized, there's a way that I'll have on the chat where you can give me a couple dollars or something if you want to support me. But you guys don't have to. You can watch me and just be my sub and and show me some love, and that'll be cool with me. Hellcat says fishing, cool. Oliver, what do you? Looking for largemouth bass. I am Oliver. Do I fish with the family? Yeah, they're uh they're at the gymnastics tonight. Seven five. Let's go. All right, Vic. I got the chatterbait on, dude. Well, I don't have a membership yet, Lewis. But um, you know, I'm not asking for no money, buddy. But when I do, if you want to pay me, I appreciate you. Everybody else, if you don't haven't already, just uh hit the sub button. And uh, I'll show you how I fish, which is a joke. I about roll my ankle right there. I don't got a lot of wind, but the conditions are dark. But the chatterbait's not a bad move.
think I need to put on the purple worm, though. Uh, I've run this bank pretty hard. Let's move along. Let's check. Let's check around the corner here. Let's do a different angle. We're anglers, right? Lewis says he's going to start a channel next month. Cool. What are you going to start it on, Lewis? What do you like to do? Yep, looking for largemouth. Oliver says he loves this dude. Oh, that's cool, man. Appreciate that. Sing a song. You must have watched. You must have watched my channel before because I'm always singing songs. Hmm. I tell you what. I promise to sing a song as long as you watch along. I won't wear a thong. Or do other things that rhyme with Ong. Oh, here's a good spot. I can hit this bank over here. So that was more of a rap. It was like bars. But um, if you hang out a little bit, I'll sing a song. Deftones is back. Cool. What's up, dude? Deftones just subbed. That's awesome. If you guys haven't subscribed, man, I'm trying to get to 1,000. Just a poor white boy out here in Florida. Trying to catch a bass for you. That was almost a bar. I have one more line. LG, last year I went, went to sea fishing and caught 25-pound American red snapper, but they were not in season. Oh, man, that's cool. Yeah, they they always bite when they're not in season, right? And those things are delicious, by the way. We do a lot of saltwater fishing. I'm going to be saltwater fishing on Saturday. Uh, I'll, be in, I'll, be in, I'll be in the saltwater on Saturday. I don't know if I'll be fishing. But I will be doing lots of saltwater fishing come here soon, guys, so check it out. Big Sweet says, throw a buzz bay. It's hard to beat the blow up. Oh, I know. Like, I got a tie. So I only have so many things with me. I showed it the guys earlier, but I've got like a couple spinner baits, a whopper plopper. That's my best top water that I got. Where's my boat? Um, I'm in the pond today, but I got my boats at the house. I got the um, bass boat charging up for uh, Keenansville on Friday, and I got the bay boat cleaned up and ready for the golf on saturday so i'm gonna be doing a lot of fishing guys make sure you like and subscribe hit the notification bell to all so uh you catch my live my live fishing deftones loves rap what about the deftones do you like the deftones like do you know who the, the deftones are that they're a band probably do oliver wants to know where my boat is love rap. every gonna at night for bigger fish I've never caught fish at night, but I have been night fishing. Oliver asked if I like to fish or golf. I do both. I do golf on Thursdays, man. I've been golfing my whole life. Longer I've been fishing. I'm a better golfer than I am a fisherman, to be honest with you. Lewis wants to talk about facts on his YouTube channel. That's cool. That's better for search-based uh, content. Oliver says, usually it's none or both. Right? I kind of the same way, dude. I get like little spurts of it. Oliver, you're like up across the pond, ain't you, buddy? You're way down there. Bix says, I was just saying, I like that. LL, you do your thing. This is awesome, brother. Oh, cool. Appreciate it. The dumb bone. Hi. What's up? I got a couple of dumb bones. You love fishing? I'll try to catch one here in a second. I got a bunch of bass stocked in this pond. I'm just trying to catch up on the live chat. Yeah, I listen to them every now and then, but my dad gave me the username. Oh, okay. <laughs> X-Pons. It's all good. People have some strange names on here. It's like it's hard to even re read them sometimes. I can do a live golf um, on Thursday when I'm in the golf tournament. I do a Thursday night men's league, so uh, I can go live. I just didn't, you know, because I have a fishing channel. I don't like going live unless I'm fishing. So, I mean, I could go live all damn day long running around the truck because I run my business out of the truck. And uh, I'm watching YouTube all damn day long. You're going to include me? Whoa. Whoa. Big blow up over here. Maybe the bass are going to start biting. 
Tell everyone to subscribe. Subscribe. Come on, everybody, please. I promise to be, uh, I don't know. I promise something. So, okay, so the best tasting fish I ever caught. If you go to my channel and look at my shorts, I just did a short on this the other day. It's funny you say that because we caught some trout uh, out in the bay last year in the Gulf and we flayed them up and stuff. And so I did a short about it. Um, it's one of my recent shorts. Go to my page or my channel and check out my shorts. And, uh, but I like sea trout, snapper, um, mahi. Those are all great. I'm going to move around a little bit. Hi, mister. What's up? Yes. Spelled out to yourself. I hear that. So in Florida right now, it's about, um, I don't have a, I can't check my clock, but I, it's somewhere between six and seven. So it's probably like 640 PM in the evening. Fishing guy. What's up? What's up, fishing guy? I'm a fishing guy. Some bass just blowed up right here by this canoe. We started this thing last time where it's like, if I get 30 likes, hang on, let me level this out. I would get in a canoe, but closest we ever got was 24. I don't want to get in that canoe, man. It's so sketchy. What's up, fishing guy? Right? Uh, at least I couldn't pronounce Deftones. Well, I grew up in the 90s, dude. Everybody subscribe to the channel. That's what the chat says. So I'm just reading it. Thanks, everybody. So, ooh. Bro, one just blew up right over here. All right, we got my boy Machine Equipment here. What's up? Put you down as a moderator. i that guy for my, like, most of my life, so he's a good dude. The golf tournament is about this time of night. It'll be about this time. It starts at actually it starts at five thirty, so like an hour before now is when it starts. But if you want, Oliver, I'll go. Uh, I'll go live Thursday at the golf tournament if that's what you want. If you guys want to watch it, I'll do it. I don't care. I love going live. Pretty good at golf. Pretty good at golf. Camera real quick. Let me make sure when I stand here, happy with my camera shot. Probably need to go throw a rubber worm on, guys. It's 6.45 right now. Yep, that's what it is here. I'm using a chatterbait right now. Oliver said it's 23, so that's like 11.45. Can everybody subscribe to Alyssa Alley? Do you guys mind? They've got a channel. It's Lewis, but goes by the alias of Alyssa Alley. Lane Lama, what's up, dude? Another OG. Original Wego there. I'm sweating my butt off, guys. MR, hey, what's up, MR? What's going on? Hello. What's up, Lane? What bait? I'm using a uh, white chatterbait, the gold thing here. But I think I need to go get a worm because there's so much hydrilla. The largest fish in this pond is almost eight pounds. Oliver's in England. So, so what time should you live? Thursday at 2200. No, I'll make it 2300 Oliver.
Ooh, they're blowing up out here. I think I need to go put on a purple worm. If you guys were watching earlier, I caught a hook the gator. I ain't seen him since. All right, let's move around. 13 you guys in here. Appreciate you. Oh, uh, we got the chats going off here. Yeah, man, I had some gator tail and taveris over the weekend. It was amazing. Trout's really good. Yep, it's around 6 p.m. here. He did it. Is that what you wanted? Machine clip to ask for that. All right, we're gonna move around the pond a little further. Hey, damn sweat towel, dude. I'm freaking like the wind stopped blowing and it's like hot, it's like 80 degrees out here. All right. Oh, I love redfish. Love me some redfish. Do I use chatterbaits? Oh, man. So I got that chatterbait on right now. Kyer, Kyler. Got the chatterbait on, dude. Right now. Yep, I use chatterbaits. We're going to try to get one right now on it. Let's see if I can get you over here. All right, we're going to cast in here. So much I drill out here. They got you guys too close. Ah, I think I'm gonna get me a purple worm. Getting late. I don't want to waste any more time. All right, I wipe my face. Hunter, what's up? What's up, Kyler? I use the rattle traps all the time. I know it's just there's so much hydrilla here. Can you see that? That's like man, these treble hooks and even this open hook on this uh, chatterbait is becoming a little bit of a nuisance. Appreciate all the likes up there, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Just uh. Spending a little Wednesday evening out here pond fishing. Dropped one button, so trying to get that's my AC. Trying to stay cool. I had a gator on earlier and it broke off my worm, so I started throwing this chatterbait. But with all this hydrilla collar, let me see if I can. Can y'all see all that hydrilla with the flowers around the edge? See, 
It's just a super nuisance. You see what bait I'm using? I was using a chatter bait with this. This is a prototype worm that I've got on there from Serious Baits. It's a bait company that I'm partners in. Um, I'm about to throw on a custom worm that I designed called the Wego Worm. So I'm going to throw that on real quick. You guys can chit chat with me for a second. See if I can get a bite on the purple worm. There's a, it's real tannic, dirty water here. And um, darker colors works pretty good. Here's what we got to choose from. Got some worms, some tackle, some bug spray. Got some spinner baits, some jigs down there. But I think I'm gonna go with the darkest Wego worm I could find. See, it's a Wego worm. It even says Wego on the tail. You can't see it because it's moving around. I don't know if you can see that or not. It says Wego. Don't mind my dirty hands. Ah. Uh. All right. Let's see if I can get you guys to sit there level. Now I'm going to tie on some leader. Hold tight. Let me grab the leader. Wouldn't you know, I don't have any leader on me. So we're going to go straight braid. Just go straight braid. It's fine. It's only 10 pound line anyways. Sorry guys, it's super hot here. I'm sweating my butt off. I'm just gonna go straight braid. Um probably gonna throw. Let me throw like a little eight ounce weight on here. That should work. A little bullet weight. Before I do that, I need to put my bobber stoppers on, right? Call them bobber stoppers, but we actually use them to peg the weights down. Grab my scissors. Appreciate all the likes, guys. If you don't mind, hit the subscribe button. I'm out here sweating my butt off. like no airflow out here i had a little gator break break me off hit my speed worm and broke it on me now i'm gonna retie and throw another one on let's see i'm gonna throw a little three odd ewg on Catch another gator. It says catch another gator. All right, see you later, Deftones. Later, buddy. Appreciate you stopping by. Just me out here today, so it's not like super interesting, but I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. I'm just doing a little pond fishing. Right now, I'm throwing a little speed worm on here. And uh, I haven't had a whole lot of luck yet. Honestly, the pond's been a little tough to fish. I'm having a lot of trouble with this because of this weight. Oh, there we go. What are you guys up to? Off the hook. What's up, buddy? I got your light right here, man. Got your light right here. When it gets dark out here, I got my headlamp. You guys see uh, off the hook in the chat there. He did a live today. And uh, he makes a lot of baits and stuff. That's what he was doing today. But uh, he was doing a review on a headlamp. And I got to commenting on it. And when you know, he sent it to me. And so I got my, I got his headlamp right here. I'm having a lot of trouble with this damn knot, though. Like I got so much weight on here. You know it is. I got zero win, and I can't get this thing to tie. Son of a gun. 
There we go. Finally got it. Anyways, check out Ted from Off the Hook Outdoors, man. That guy's cool. He's got a bait store, apparel, really cool channel. He does a lot of hunting and he just did a video on trout fishing. There you go. Check out Off the Hook Outdoors. Really cool. Good dude. Like I said, I was just commenting on his channel and he sends sends me a a headlamp. I mean, that was pretty cool. I think I just asked him how much it was. What his braid does not want to cut. Those scissors are not good. Uh yeah, there we go. Anyways, I got the my custom bait. I'm sweating my butt off, guys. It's hot out here in Florida. The Wego worm. Oliver says it's midnight now. That means it's seven here. That means I've been going live for an hour. But uh, I'll take you guys around a little longer. We'll do another 20 minutes. Yeah, I just caught a little gator about 30 minutes or so ago and couldn't get him through the hydrilla. I got him all the way up to the shore with 10 pound with 10 pound leader. And uh Anyways, he broke me off, so I started throwing the chatterbait for a little while, but no luck. So we're back to throwing this Wego worm, which has been working pretty good. So anyway, we're going to be taking a bunch of these things to Keenansville. I'll tell you that. This worm I grabbed wasn't the newest worm. Let's just say that. It's got some wear and tear to it. So... Appreciate you guys tuning in. Just a little pond fishing out here on a, on a Wednesday. This looks like a pretty good spot. Doing my live on a tripod just like you, Ted. Oliver Bailey, what's your favorite fish? Uh, man, I don't know. I like to catch a lot of trout. Any Anything that comes out of the ocean uh, inshore is pretty good if you, if you, if you uh, eat it fresh. I'll be doing a lot of that here soon. A lot of saltwater fishing, that is. Well, the gator's back. We're going to catch this gator, guys. I got straight braid this time. Let's do that. Let's catch this gator again. I see him now. Y'all want me to catch this gator? We got 12 of you in here. What do you want to do? I'm going to start a poll. Should we catch the gator, yes or no? Oh, uh, wait a minute. Why can't I start a poll? I don't know what's going on. I can't start a poll. What's going on, Vic? I got a triple or nothing with Eddie. That ain't been working out good for me. I don't, I'm, I'm not big on tuna. Did I look at my back pocket? <laughs> what the heck? That's funny. Good eye, Vic. This thing was stuck to my back pocket. It's so funny. I'd have lost this somewhere. Vic just saw this jig stuck to my pocket. You guys didn't say nothing? Sitting there just hanging around, just hanging around, walking around with a jig on my pocket, like Eeyore. Try it? All right, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try some tuna. Do you like it? Like, are you talking about like in a can? Or is it like cooked? Or what is it? What's the kind of tuna are you talking about? DTS. Yes. Yeah. Thank God I didn't sit down. Oh, I'm getting a phone call. Sorry, guys. Thank God I didn't sit on that thing. Vic's laughing his ass off. <laughs>
You guys like live fishing? Make sure you subscribe. Sorry, I was out of the shot there. Mr. Who go? I'm fishing in the middle of Florida, north central Florida in the woods at a family pond. Sorry, my tripod keeps getting shorter. Let me fix this real quick, guys. Bear with me. I'm show you the pond and extend the legs on the tripod. Sorry about that. There we go. Stood you back up a little bit. Lewis said he created two new videos. Awesome. I'm checking them out, Lewis, as soon as I get done. And I'm subbing. Where'd that jig go? Oh, it's on the ground now. Man, I got to catch a fish for my people now. Oh, no, don't cry. I'm so glad that, uh, hopefully I inspired you to do it. I don't know. Oh, is that a fish? Oh, I almost felt like a fish right there, but I didn't get anything. Yeah, I hope I inspired you to, I don't know, start a YouTube channel. That's cool. Uh, go fishing. Be nice to people. You've actually straightened me out a little bit. I was getting a little too crazy on here. and Start listening to people and they're like, well, maybe I should think about what I say a little bit. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Let's do this. Let's go to the back of the pond of the sweet spot. And uh, we'll see how, how we do back there. And then we'll, uh, we'll call it. Um, I've worked a long, hard day. And I've actually got... I probably shouldn't say anything because I don't know if my kids are watching. But there's a little surprise coming in the middle of the night tonight. Be a new addition to the channel. By... Uh, it's a B U L L D O G. So obviously my kids are little, they can't spell. So we've got a a little P U P P Y coming tonight. In like middle of the night. So that's when it's getting delivered from Pennsylvania. But uh, it's gonna be so cool. We're gonna have a little B U L D U D O G P U P P Y. So sorry guys, I'm spelling as fast as I can. We're going to have that on the channel here pretty soon, so it'll be kind of cool. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I came up. Thank you. Let's cast that right in the tree. It's a big problem out here. The trees are bad. I've actually broke a rod out here. I've actually broke a rod out here because I uh, I got hung up and I was trying to get out. Big old ditch pickle. Honey hole, let's go. This is the second best spot. I got one more spot around the corner. But I'll try this spot.
Start cool off a little bit now. The sun went down. Future Venom. Hi. What's up? What's up, guys? That change it always changes, so I don't know what to believe anymore. And if that's the cat case, then uh, I'll do my best to show you um, to be a good mentor. I'll try. I recommend fishing. Good for the soul. You don't have to. You don't have to eat the fish. You can always throw them back. But it's also a good way to catch a dinner too. I should have grabbed a better worm. See, I'm kind of getting stuck. See, you, Oliver, appreciate you. You guys check out Alicia Alley and uh, check out the channel. Make sure you like and subscribe because they are a big supporter of this channel. And I appreciate that. Got 13 of you guys in here. If you haven't, uh, give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe. I'm out here walking around the family pond. It's warm. It's not cold. It's like 80 something degrees. So I'm doing some sweating because I got to do some off road training around here. This is this is old Florida here. Look at this pine rose. There's a little pond out. There's a little pond out here in the middle of it. All right, what we got? Oh, anytime, anytime, Lewis. Anytime, buddy. Wish you the best. Right, I'm going to sit up right here. This is a good spot. I won't be able to read the chat. It is muddy in here. I usually catch a fish right here. You guys will watch my channel. I've caught some fish right here. Let me adjust the camera. I don't know how many likes I got on this thing, but if you haven't already, please exit out the chat and just like it real quick and uh, you can pop right back in. Ooh, I smell something dead. I smell something dead. I wonder what that's all about. Ugh. I smell something dead around here. I don't see any dead fish or anything. Guys, I'm trying. I'm sorry. Working my butt off over here. Trying to catch a fish.
Ooh. Got a big bite. Where's the gator? And gator sitting right in the fishing spot. Okay. He's like catching. Here he comes. He's coming right at me. Are you ready? We're going to catch the skater. Oh. We just missed it. Right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, if I'm gonna catch a skater, I gotta get this weight off of here. Deftones is back. All right. What's up, Candler Story? Let me do this. I'm gonna run this weight way up. See if that makes a difference. We got a little gator in our pond. Man, I smell something dead. Smell something dead. I think he killed something. No, I haven't had any luck. I don't have my scissor way. Trying to cut this 10 pound braid. There we go. I'm going to take this weight off and we'll catch this gator again. No, I'm going to catch this gator though. Got, if you have any weight on the worm, it sinks too quick and they hit stuff right on the top of the water. See how good a knot I can tie real quick. I haven't had very much luck out here tying my knots on the live. 15 likes. Thanks, guys. See if we can get to a thousand subs. Where am I at? How many subs do I got, guys? I had like a 941 before I started. Bassin with the boo going viral. Oh, wait, B. Y'all check out B Mass Fishing. He just tuned in here. He's got a new video. It's really good with his uh, boo. Oh, my God. This has been the worst today, trying to get this damn. There we go. Sorry, guys. I'm having the worst time trying to tie a knot today. These Wego knots are tough to tie. Damn. We had 961. Let's go, people. Y'all are great. Let's go. I'm going to catch. Don't worry about that tag. I have no way of cutting it. But we're catching alligators out here. We ain't catching big ones, but we're catching gators right now. Watch this, guys. I'm about to catch alligators. He's right in the middle of the screen out here. Oh, I didn't get it to him. He damn, he's coming at it. He's coming at it. Here we go. Ready? Oh! It hit him on the head. I thought he caught it. 
I mean, that thing literally hit him. It's not what I was trying to do. For some reason, this thing's not casting real good. He's still up, though. What is going on? I feel like something's broke. What is going on with my rod? That's a weird sound. Oh. My bobber stopper's still on there. Wee boo. Dude, I'm doing all my. Ow. I'm using all my tooth strength today. All right. You ready? About to catch an alligator. Y'all need to tune in because about to catch an alligator right now. Let's go. Oh, she's casting now. Ooh, he's right there. Y'all see that gator? So I'm casting right to him. I need to get. I gotta get it past him so he can find it. Sorry, guys. I lost you there for a second. Sorry about that. I'm getting the gator. I'm getting the gator. I looked back and something was going live. So we're back. Deftone sub. Thank you. If you guys haven't subscribed. Ooh. Oh, my goodness. He almost got that. He almost got that. Uh, I'm going to bring you guys up here because he's going to get it. He's going to get it. All right, guys. We're catching gators right now. We're catching gators right now. Get ready. A little gator right there. Ooh. I could just get it a little further past him. You're right, because it's going to splash right there. I just got to run this speed worm right across his nose, and he's going to hit it. Come on, Gator. He goes for it every time. I just don't. You see it? You guys see him moving? Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, he went. He missed it. Did y'all see that? Are y'all able to see that? No, you can't see it. Let's see if I can put you right on it. He's right. He's like right there. He's like right. Like right. Where is he at? He's like right in this area. Watch. He has a little head out.
Man, I'm having some trouble casting. I got no weight on this thing. That's how you catch them. Oh, he went for it. He missed it. You guys see that in ripples? Deftones. There you go, buddy. Thanks for being thanks for being loyal. We're about to catch this gator. Oh God. He bit the worm. He's already bit the tail off my speed worm, so it's that's my trouble. Well, I don't see him now. You there? Yeah, he's still there. He just didn't move. Come on, Gator. Oh, he missed it again. Did you guys see that? BJ Slayer. Thanks. What's up? We're just trying to bass fish. We got a little gator. We got a little gator action now. Did he get it? Did he get it? Oh, he missed it again. I might have to run over and give a speed tail worm. Uh-oh. Oh! That was it. I just broke off. Dang it, guys. Just got stuck up in the tree. All right, well, guys, we caught one gator. Could have caught another. But um, just got hung up in the tree, so I think that's an omen. I got a little uh, P-U-P-P-Y showing up in the middle of the night tonight, so uh, I'm going to get to bed early. But I appreciate you guys tuning in. I'm going to be uh, doing some live fishing Friday. In Keenansville with uh once again B Mass Fishing, No Name Bassin, and Small Water Charter. So check out those channels and uh make sure you like and subscribe those guys. Uh, I'm also gonna check out um Alicia Alley's channel when I get off of here. And uh thanks for everybody else who uh who's been here. Scotchy, what's up? Oh, so I was running the bait so fast because there's a gator back there. I mean if you guys want, I'll tie on, I'll tie on a speed worm. I'll try to catch him. If you guys want, otherwise we're going to end this thing. We've got five folks in here. I'm in a little family pond. Scotchy, I just broke off in the tree. So I'm going to, um, I was thinking about calling the live. It's been going for like, I don't know, two hours or something. No, probably an hour and a half, but, uh, I'm going to be back live Friday and Saturday. So if you guys haven't, make sure you subscribe and I click the notification bell to all. And next time I'm live, I'll, uh, it'll give you a notification. You won't miss it. But until next time, guys, tight lines, subscribe. Thank you guys so much. Peace. I'm going to be live on uh, Retire Brothers, Scotchy. I just did an outro. All right. Tell you what. We'll go back to that gator one time. It's getting kind of dark here, though. Since I got seven of you guys in here, 16 likes. If you guys want me to keep fishing, I'm going to need seven more likes. So we got 16. Some of you guys probably already have liked. Let's get to 20. If we can get to 20 likes, I'll continue to fish. If not, we're going to call it a night, and I'll see you guys next time on Friday. Down in uh, Lake, Lake Okeechobee area, Keenansville. See, we'll see what the likes go up to. Yeah, I'm gonna rip off this thing. This thing's got a little leader on it. Gonna work a little better. 18 likes. It's close. Seven of you guys in here. Tell you what, if you guys like and subscribe, I'll, I'll, I'll continue to fish. Everybody in here likes and subscribes. Got eight of you guys.
What are y'all up to? You want me to read your poem? Man, I love tying this leader, this uh, floral. It's so much easier than that braid. Oh, don't worry about it. Deftones, appreciate you wanting to donate. I'm not far from that, guys. If I get to 1,000 subs, I'm going to start I'm gonna start doing special things like that for my uh, fan club. Some sort of membership or something. Where you guys get some exclusive stuff. Have I ever fished in Lake Crone? No. All right, here we go. I'm going to throw my... Custom Wego worm. So, here when I start a membership, maybe I'll have things like I give you guys custom baits. This is my special bait that I came up with. Oliver says, "Cool, I'll join it." That's awesome. I didn't think I'd have that kind of following, dude. I didn't think you guys would cared like that. That's amazing. Wow. Okay. Defton says he loves the content. He'll definitely join. All right, that's that's awesome. I'm, I'm going to keep doing it. I just started the channel in November. All right, let's run back there and give that gator a run for his money because uh, I got I got a gator catching set up right now. Lake Livingston, London, Arthur. Wow, so I'm from uh, Ocala, Florida, but we fish in uh, Crystal River and a lot of freshwater spots around here. I'll tell my friends about you. That's awesome. Just share. Go to my um, my channel and share one of the videos or something. That'd be cool. I got to get some watch time hours, guys. I got to get uh, get some of you guys watching my videos. Uh, I haven't done a whole lot of, like, uh, GoPro widescreen uh, horizontal videos because I've been so busy with work. So I've been doing a lot of this vertical live. It's just easier. And uh, if something cool happens, I tend to turn it into a, a little video. I caught that gator earlier. I never got him up to show him, but stuff like that. You never know. You can make a little video out of it. 18 likes. I'm walking over here anyways, guys. I'm going to fish for you. Don't worry. Close enough. Close enough. I feel the love. London Arthur says his dad's from California. Are you crazy? Are you kidding me? That's so cool. Alicia Alley says he's back. Lewis. Lewis is back. Yeah, I never did leave, dude. Never did leave. I decided to go back and get a purple worm for this gator. I'm going to show you guys this gator. I think it'll be funny. I'm not going to hurt him. I'm just going to take I'm just going to throw him back. Or, I don't think I'm going to even touch him. I'll probably just let him break off. But maybe I can get him close enough to show you guys. A Florida gator. Some stinks like dead animal over here. All right. Not sure I see him. But if this speed worm starts running across the front, he'll show up right off the top of the water. Florida gator's mad. We're about to find out. There we go. There's the pond. I literally have to get him through all this hydrilla. All that. It's a ways. Yeah, he's right there. Oh, he's right there. I'm going to get him with a with seed worm. Because this thing's going to kick a little more water. We alligator fishing. Oh, that was the one. We alligator fishing here. There we go. Here it is. Oh, I just run it across the back of his head right behind his eye. Can't believe he didn't move for that. Damn. He only wants to move like three, four inches. I literally got to hit him right in the nose with it. Oh. 
Man, he's being lazy. Oh, that was a perfect cast. I'm going. I'm trying to get him. What's my real name? Hmm. They call me Wego. Let's see if I can get a better angle because he's going to hit this thing. He's right here underneath this tree. He's like right. He's like right over here. He's like sitting right here. You can't see him, but when he hits this worm, you're going to see a water move. He's sitting right there. Oh, my God. Oh my goodness, this thing's, he just keeps like missing it. Sorry, guys. We go, one word. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh. Did y'all see that? He broke it. He cut my line. Oh, no. He just ate the worm off. Did y'all see that? We got two of you guys in here. But I don't know. That's it. He got the Wego worm again. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Until next time. Tight lines. Peace. Later, Wegos.